house design is a critical stage while constructing, be it a residential or business building. This is the opposite when one looks at the housing setup of Kibera Slum. The houses are built with no respect to house design or any construction protocols. A mere look at the shacks that Kibera residents call a board reveal nothing but the dark side, that is, old rusty corroded iron sheets hanging on mud built walls with a dirty surrounding. However, a visit into the rooms brings out the artistic nature of the slum dwellers. The minute was Charles Oriedo, Oriedo Manjinam Tani. Every day himself who feel could she better life. Na could she better life ni? See all as the structure ni brain. You know better life. So Nezara who up even and you better life. Ni brain. As the adage goes, utilize the little you have to the peak of satisfaction. A manoeuvre through the so-called choches, a term used by the locals in place of pathways, to explore the Indian nature of the slum households left us astounded, as the state of artwork revealed to us was exceptional. Despite limited space, the houses we visited were furnished and arranged with an artistic touch. The pairs of sofa and television sets punched out of mind the negative perception we had before getting the real look of things indoors. Kenilikuwa nile desire kuwa na opoa na siku nataka kuwa manitoke geto juu nimezaliwa geto napenda geto so nikaamua wacha ni mekikwe kama zile zingine ndio hata nisisonge niende kuingine nikaenda kutafuta place nyingine nikuwe kibichi na nikuwe na nikuwe satisfied na kitu nilikuwa nataka uh, wazazi wakaama wakaenda madhare notu huko sasa mimi nikaona ai mbona nikae huko na eh uh, nikaona acha nikomboe tu nyumba nimeanza kuomba nyumba mwezi wa tatu na vitu nimeanza kununua hapa nimengangana tu nikungangana kwa aso kidogo kidogo tu naweka ndo nanunua vitu to our surprise some houses even had indoor bathrooms and kitchens despite mega earnings most kibera dwellers spare a fraction for investing in a beautiful home mimi na permanent job lakini kuna permanent capital of which ni brain yangu so many hustlers. How's the kibiji ziko sawa as long as vile ukizitunza zitakatu kama house nyingine. Inalingana vile unazitunza repair nini vitu ndogo ndogo kama hizo. Me kimi mwenyewe mimi hawa yangu lazima tutoe smart code bado mimi ni youth. Lazima alafu bado nikao watu kama guest lazima wakue wakuja wakuja lazima tuone aone smart. Ni pia mimi mpenye na pia the offer, television and other technology equipment owned by the households in Kibera show how technologically advanced the residents are. The more we grow, the more we are going to grow more. So technology is going to be able to create creativity. If you look at the TV, you will see that there is no doubt. You will always imagine what you are going to do. But lakini kingena ni hao unapataka hao ni smart. I mean I advise my boy, my youth. And then tukuchanganya kwa mapema. Usiongoje sasa unafikisha 30 ndio unaanza unataka kuanza kununua kitanda. One resident once said, if you cannot respect me, you will respect my humble abode. Beauty is from the inside. The paths to the houses are muddy and slippery. The walls are made of mud and the roofs are brown and rusty. But once you get inside some of the houses, you realize Kibera residents can make a home out of not so much of a house. You call it a slum, but they call it a home. Maureen Gitai, reporting for Kibera TV, Nairobi.